listen to the roar. We are all over Pakistan. Four overs in, Rizlan's gone for four. It's two for 15, and I've never seen the MCG like this. In, in to Asif. Oh. most of the balls. No, no, Shane Sharp, Freedy, as clean as a whistle, big boundary. That's why you love this game, because the momentum now at Bin swings back to Pakistan. Ashdick, first moment of pressure for him tonight. He's back in, he goes to a Freedy, who collapses the ball. The umpire bombs to Rahul, chopped it on! Nassim Shah strikes in the second over. Kaya Rahul departs for four. India, one for seven. Call for the wicket and there it is. That length again, we've been asking the Pakistani bowlers to find that length. Just the second ball with it, Rahul was rushed into just Leaving his bat out there, inside edge board. Ahmed Nawaz begins around the wicket. Pandya clears the front pad, whacks it to mid wicket. Six. A statement of intent. Nawaz bowls. Coley's out of his crease, long down the ground. Six runs. There's a grace in the way that Virat Coley does it. Some, it's all muscle and impulse. Not with Virat Kohli. Precise footwork. He got the length that he wanted. He swung his arms, as you said, beautifully through the ball. 28 off eight. Kohli's got to find a boundary against Ralph. Kohli stands his ground straight down the ground. He lifted it up. That is a shot of an emperor. A straight six down the ground. To the back, cloaking on the seats. 68 from 49 balls for at Kohli, two sixes and six fours. He still needs something off this delivery. 22 off seven. Ralph in and at him. Kohli lifts it up to five length. It carries for six. The man is a genius. He's not just a king, he's a genius. Back to back sixes. Oh, India man. needs 16 to win off the last over. Four for 144. I know I've used a few tonight, Jared. I've used Bill Laurie. Can I refer to someone I think you think is the greatest? The world holds its collective breath. Yes. Not with Kathy on the blocks, with Virat at the G. <laughs> 15 required from four. Nawaz is throwing them in hard. He bowls. Full tops. Coley got him up. Out to mid wickets. Knocked back for six. Knocked for six. It was a leap on the boundary from Asif. They're signalling four. I, I reckon it's going to be six. Oh. I had the binoculars on yep. that. Asif leapt into mid air, knocked it down. He yep. looked the other side of the padding. Oh, and it's a no ball. It's a no ball. Six, no ball. R. Ashwin to face the last ball again. To win the game for India. 
and set the emotions of billions soaring. Nawaz in, goes to Ashwin, drives for the win! Up over the top of mid off for four! India win magnificently on an unforgettable night at the MCG. There was a sense we would see something special at the MCG tonight when India and Pakistan met. And as it turns out, we saw something absolutely unforgettable. A cultural celebration, a noise at the ground like I've never heard before. And the return of the king, Virat Kohli, turned in perhaps his best white ball innings to conjure a quite stunning victory. Bharat Sundaresan, in, in in the annals of games between these two teams, is it'll never be forgotten at this ground. It will become instantly part of MCG folklore, but there's something broader to it, having lived through those events. I know, very much so. Uh, and like you said, uh, you know, to do it at the MCG in front of so many people, and, and it almost, you know, there are so many of these people who call Australia home. And this is the only time they kind of get to celebrate where they come from. You know, and the only time they get to do that with Pakistanis. You know, Indians and Pakistanis were mingling and having a great time before the match began. And Indians and, Indians and Pakistanis are having a great time while the match yeah. is on. And, and just the noise. I said at, during our call, you can't make out whether it's the Indian crowd cheering or Pakistan crowd cheering just by the noise. Yes. And we saw that through the night. And then for Virat Kohli to produce that kind of noise. I know Pakistan lost, but I think more than India-Pakistan, the last 40 minutes of that match was all about Virat Kohli. I think it was a celebration of Virat Kohli, what he's done all these years and why we are, why this is the Virat Kohli era of World Cup. Darren Berry, so the cricket was a little bit mad and quite magnificent. It was chaos. The game had everything plus tax. This venue, the greatest stadium in the world for us Victorians, has witnessed some great sporting events, Olympic Games, Commonwealth Games, AFL Grand Finals, you name it. For me, as a 53-year-old man, that's the greatest sporting event that I've witnessed at this ground. The atmosphere from go to woe was electric, and the finale, to need 16 off the last over and to take it to the last ball, it's I, it was a privilege to be yeah, here. It, it was really amazing, was. absolutely amazing. We were lucky, we were blessed. There were 90,000 here to, to talk about it, I think, for the rest of their lives. So, SEN's coverage of the T20 World Cup. Uh, good luck to whoever goes next. <laughs> What's tomorrow's game? Bangladesh and the Netherlands. There probably should be a three-day pause yes. before we resume the rest of the, t the, uh, the tournament, but we're headlong into it. But this tournament, I feel like it will probably always be defined by this game.